hello everyone welcome to how to fix tech in this video guys we are going to fix the issue in accessible boot device your pc ran into problems and needs to restart so there are several reasons behind this error the first one reason could be the damaged system files i mean the corruption inside your windows files second one is faulty update if you have recently update the windows and those windows update are not compatible with your windows so you might get this issue as well the third option or the third error could be the loose connection if your hard drive or the ssd is not connected properly so you have to check that and you need to make sure that there is no loose connection if it is the open that and simply clean the hard drive with the tissue paper and then reinsert it firmly reason of this error the fourth one could be the bad hard drive corruption inside your hard drive the bad sector inside your hard drive so whatever error you are getting and whatever the cause i'm here to fix the issue so so if you are able to access this screen like this advanced screen so well and good if not you need to forcefully shut down your system two to three times as soon as the window loads you just need to press the power key for almost 15 seconds and repeat the process for almost two to three times now once you get that you should get the automatic repair options or a startup repair could not repair your pc options so once you're on that you need to click on the advanced options then you need to click on the troubleshoot and also if you are not able to access the screen after following this method you have to make the bootable pen drive and then come on this piece click on advanced options then simply open the command prompt so once you have opened the command prompt the first command you need to type is sfc space slash scan now so this command will basically repair the windows corruptions Okay, once this command is executed we need to repair the boot errors related window is not booting so we need to hit the commands here guys the first command we need to hit here is uh, make sure you are in the boot directory boot rec space forward slash fix boot so if you see the access is denied so don't worry we need to hit the command here so command is boot sec space forward slash nt60 and space sys once this is done we need to again hit another command and fix boot execute same command now it is completed successfully now the next command we need to type here is boot track space fix mbr this time as shown on the screen and hit this so i forward the d here so I need to type a rebuilt BCD as shown on the screen and type exit and now I suggest you to turn on your PC and then turn it on again back if still not fixed then go to advanced options command prompt and this time we will repair the bed sectors so first of all we need to make sure that we are in the right directory I mean the where window has been installed so let me dir as you can see my window is not installed in the c drive when I press c colon then dir so let me type here the d colon then the dir we are in the d directory so my window is installed in the d directory as you can see windows users program files is here so we need to hit the command accordingly here so type the command chk dsk space forward slash f space forward slash r and space then the drive letter d so you can change it to the c if it is installed in the c and then y and hit enter so once this command is executed this will go to the five stages guys so you need to just wait here until it gets completed automatically so you have to wait here I'm closing here to save your time sometime it may stuck so just wait for the sometime just stick with that so 
so I'm closing this and I suggest you to turn off your PC once command is completed and then turn it on and it will fix the issue if nothing is working guys we have another fix for you and that is system restore go to troubleshoot advanced options and if you have made the system restore point or windows makes it so you are lucky then you can choose the date wise so in my case system restore is not made so I have to cancel that you can restore your system when your system was working fine with the all the system registry files including your data application no harm to your data so choose that and once done if nothing is working we have the last fix for you that is reset 